Hello and welcome to Wednesday's financial news. Stay with us for more market headlines. The dollar-yen pair has added 0.2% in the last session. The MACD has shot up into the positive zone. The price of gold has gained 1.7% in the last two sessions. Stochastic is diminishing into the positive area. Bitcoin has fallen 1% in the last session. The ATR shifted into the high volatility zone. The Aussie dollar pair has fallen 0.3% in the last session. The ultimate oscillator moved sharply into negative territory. Coming up, the choices from our chief analyst for today. Apple is threatening to remove apps from its widely used app store if they don't comply with an upcoming private feature allowing users to block advertisers from tracking them across different applications. Standard Chartered has gathered a group of crypto exchanges for a new digital asset trading platform tailored to the institutional market. Investors clearly expect the COVID-19-induced economic dip to end soon and earnings to reach new highs in the near future. Those were today's major economic events and now moving on to world financial headlines. The Japanese machine tool orders will be released at 600 GMT, the German trade balance at 700 GMT, the U.S. jolts job openings at 1500 GMT, the Canadian BOC interest rate decision at 1500 GMT, the U.S. crude oil inventories at 1530 GMT, and the Japanese PPI at 2350 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed Wednesday's Market Outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to join us tomorrow morning for the latest news and events from the financial markets.